you know, our sport is growing. Fans are growing, TV ratings are growing. All that is going the right way. The only thing we don't have right now is a lot of people that ride motorcycles. Everyone right now in this industry, we're all trying to figure out how to get more riders. My kids, I fought it for a while. I didn't want them to ride, but they love it. I grew up riding, I love it. I still ride to this day. Like all our fans that ride, they change their, the way they talk because of racing motorcycles. What, you know, everything you do is all about riding. So we just need to get more people involved. We, we do want to help elevate the sport. If they start living motorcycles, they will be fans and they will be in it forever. Once you're a motorcycle fan, you don't leave. You stay a motorcycle fan. I'm happier where I live. I'm happier with, with you know, everybody I'm working with day to day. You know, I'm closer to the shop. I'm closer to, with everybody. I'm, I'm just gelling with everybody really well. Like, we, we get along, it's cool. Um, I'm gelling with the bike really well, gelling with the track, gelling with the idea that I can go out in the, in the sticks and do what I want. I can shoot my guns, I can work on the track, I can do, you know, I can just do whatever I want. And so all that is how I grew up doing it. And that's what I loved about motocross, is just all of these things, so. And then on top of all of that, you have the most ridiculous amount of resources with these guys. And then you can go to a top of the line gym at the cup shop just down the street here. And it's like, you have everything you need as a dirt biker. Like if you're here, you're dialing. <laughs> I think now that my program's figured out that I'm happy with what I'm doing and I believe in everything that, I mean, it just reminds you why you do this. And it, to me, it, it feels like when I first turned pro and everything's exciting. Like it's, it's crazy when you really think about it or if you get hurt and you kind of get brought back down to earth and reminded like, okay, really like, not stupid, you can do something else, but do you really want to? No, probably not. It's pretty badass being able to do this, you know? And not a lot of people get to do what they love for a living. I mean, you're gonna get frustrated and you're gonna have a tough time staying focused with anything you do, but I mean, not a lot of people get to snap back into reality and their reality is going to ride a supercross track for a factory Suzuki team, you know what I mean? You know, for many years I thought you had to be so selfish in the sport and you do to an extent but it's okay to cheer other guys on and build other guys up and, and help people on your team grow and it's only gonna bring good things back to you and when you're putting out good vibes and you're helping people people want to help you and it's it's that's what this team is about everyone's helping everyone try to get that goal and win races and win championships a lot of the guys like I almost consider them really really good friends you know I'll go out have a beer with them or I'll go hang out with their families and stuff like that so it's uh it's not just a rider team deal, it's more like friends for me. It's amazing to see what Joe has done in his football career and then transitioning it into NASCAR and then bringing Coy over here to do the moto side. It's just amazing how much they've given back to the community, especially in Charlotte. Everyone here, they see me with a JGR hat. They're like, oh, those are great people. Those are awesome people. They help the community. They do this. So it's, it's such a different environment that you see in California. Everyone's a little high strung, high stressed. This is pretty laid back, but we're also here to do our job and win races. We all get along really good. Uh, there's no real big egos. We all try to help each other out on the track and off the track. You know, they're not your real buddies unless they're giving you crap all the time, so. <laughs> I do believe when a rider's comfortable, they're at their best, you know, so having that comfort, having everything they need, trusting in JGR, Suzuki, Yoshimura, Auto Trader, all those key sponsors that are going to help them be able to perform at their top, you know, that's something that every rider looks for. And the more that's put together by the team gelling and everything being one cohesive package, that allows them to show up and be confident. Everybody's happy, everybody's having fun, it's a good time, it's, it's throwing jokes, talking crap on each other, and it's, it, it keeps it 
easier to, to keep on going every day when you go to your work environment and everybody's smiling and everybody's having fun. It's good to have that kind of um, energy around to help us get what we need to do. The whole company is about your family. Like they try to do a lot of things to help you in your life. It's not just a race team. Racing's what they do, but it's not what they are.